do you know what living things need to survive? Can we find life on other planets? Before we explore other worlds that could support life, let's explore what living things on Earth need to survive. From the tiniest creatures to the largest animals, all living things need certain things to keep them alive and healthy. One of these things is air. The air on Earth is made up of different gases that living things need to survive. For example, humans, animals and plants all take in oxygen. They then release carbon dioxide. Oxygen is very important for all living things for many reasons, including turning food into energy. Plants also need carbon dioxide to create energy. They take in carbon dioxide through their leaves and release oxygen. This is called photosynthesis and is how plants make their own food. All living things need water. It helps keep humans and animals cool and is important for chemical reactions inside their bodies. Plants need water to grow and stay strong too. They take water through their roots and release it through tiny holes in their leaves. Water provides support and helps plants to stay upright as water fills their cells. Leaves being upright means they can reach for the sunlight. Food is how humans and animals get their energy. It's also how they get the building blocks they need to build and repair their bodies and reproduce. Different types of food are important for different things. Protein is important for building muscles, while sugar gives quick energy. Fats are important for keeping our brains and hearts healthy. Plants can make the food they need through photosynthesis. They use sunlight and carbon dioxide to make sugars and water from the soil to grow, repair and reproduce. Sugars, fats and proteins are important to keep all living things healthy. Sunlight is important for plants to make their food and many animals eat plants for food. Other animals eat a mixture of plants and animals while some animals only eat other animals. When we link the different plants and animals together, we get a food web. This shows how energy flows through lots of different living things. Shelter is also important. Smaller plants may shelter under larger plants, like a big tree giving shade from the hot sun, to grass or flowers growing below it. Many plants reproduce by seed. Seeds need protection from the sun and cold to grow. Soil is a great shelter for seeds and protects them from animals that might eat them. When the conditions are correct and the seed grows to a new plant, the soil provides nutrients and water. Just like humans have houses, some animals, like birds, build nests high up in the trees to keep their babies safe. Others, like rabbits and foxes, dig holes in the ground to create burrows. Some sea creatures live around reef structures, where the living coral creates its protective skeleton reef. The reef makes a safe place for fish, crabs and many other creatures to shelter from larger predators. All living things need air, water, food and shelter to survive and thrive. Earth is a unique and special planet that has everything humans, animals and plants need to survive. But not all planets can provide this. Let's explore our solar system to find out why. Mars has too much carbon dioxide in its atmosphere for humans and animals to breathe. Plants might like the carbon dioxide, but there isn't any water. Because plants can't survive, there aren't any trees for shelter. No plants and animals mean no food webs to support other life. Venus has even more carbon dioxide in its atmosphere than Mars, and there isn't any liquid water there either. Like Mars, animals and plants can't find the air, water, food and shelter they need to survive. 
Jupiter and Saturn are known as the gas giants. Their atmosphere contains no oxygen and very little carbon dioxide. Because they are made of gas and have no solid surface, there is no water to drink or take up from the soil, and no shelter can be found there either. This makes Earth our special home. It has everything we need to survive and thrive, 